It's really easy to create plots directly from Pandas data frames. Pandas plotting is really just a wrapper for matplotlib, but it hides a lot of the details, making it a lot easier to use than matplotlib. One of the nice things about making plots with pandas is that it's able to guess a lot of things about how you want to make the plot. It will use the row label index for the x-axis by default, so you don't actually have to specify that. And if you have multiple columns, they will typically be added to the plot automatically, with each column being another line or whatever feature is in the plot. If you want a plot other than a simple line plot, you can specify the kind of plot by using the kind equals argument. There are many other features of the plot that can be controlled by other arguments that you pass into the plotting function, but we won't dwell on this too much because if you want to get into anything more than the simplest plots, you'll probably want to use matplotlib anyway. Let's start with the simplest kind of plot, a line graph. We're going to use some data from the New York Times on the progress of the COVID-19 epidemic over time. We can see that the data consists of three columns, the date, the number of cases, and the number of deaths. It's quite easy to plot this by simply using COVID and then the plot method. It will default to kind equals line, so we don't actually have to specify that. This plot leaves some things to be desired. In particular, the x-axis just has the numbers for each of the cells in the data frame. Since the data includes the dates, it would be much nicer to just have the dates be the x-axis labels. We can accomplish this by turning the values in the date column into date-time objects and then set those as the label indices for the rows. Here's how I do the conversion to date time with the format that is used in the data set. I will make this conversion and replace the date column with the date time object and then set the index to be that date time object. Here it is in the revised data frame. Now all I have to do is run the plot again and the labels are now shown as dates instead of numbers.